Underway, it's finals day of the men. Two, it's Chris O'Reilly with you. Delauga, Gietzel looking to take on his man. Facing France for the first time in this championship, and that's a great breakthrough down the left-hand side. Close by Vincent Girard, and Nikola Karabatic looking to go alone. Girard, and Nikola Karabatic looking to go alone, and it's tipped by the defenders, and a coach. There is a breakthrough. At one. Range home into the centre, Kierkegaard looks to go alone, that's blocked down, picked up, and fast break opportunity here for Hugo Desca. And there's your first goal of the game, will give him a bit of a boost at the beginning of this one. Well, that one squeezed right arm free to place it past Gerard. 1-1. Spin, oh, and a great pass behind the back as well, Desca again. And Saves at the near post again, right at the beginning, a very dynamic and fluid Danish backcourt in attack but not a lot of firepower that's great pass out to the wing but no goal given stand inside there we'll see from the replay line with Carl Cornan looking to cut out this opportunity for Lauga and it's again a near post shot and parried away four saves from Fokta Karabatic there's a space there on the line but the ball goes out to the wing and said and this time no championship always looking to Play the balls out to the wing early doors here, and it is a very beneficial thing for the wing players as we switch out to Mahe. Ball into the uh, line, and it's the winger. Janis Lark in the main round. Ball by Kirkaluka out to the wing. Lassesvan. Oh, saved again, Gerard. Reading these shots very well. Nice movement right at the end. Both sides going at this. Hammer and tongs. Uh, and Jakob Holm again. Goal for him in this game, third goal for Denmark. Save at the near post this time by Nicholas Landin. Tried to pass it play. Lauga squeezes that one past Gerard. Mahe. Karabadic out to the wing. Hugo Desca tries to fool Nicholas as he's caught out. Kirkeloka back to home. Knock up home. 43. Kirkeloka, and it's another one for Gerard. Another fast break opportunity down the left hand side for Hugo Desca. This time he makes no minutes. Oh, early warning signs. It's a brilliant spin by Jakob. Control. France looking to respond immediately. Ball into Yanis Len. Oh, it's champagne handball here at the start of the. We're just a bit too slow in coming back. Up the space here for Kirkeloka. Could have gone alone and said. Gives it out to the wing. Not a great angle. One pass too many. Kirkeloka. Could and should have taken that one on himself and on the wing. It's a good eye look to take on the defender himself. Cuts on my hey. That's batted away. Lauga. Out to Mensa. Kirkeloka trying to help out. That's much better, but a good save again. Vincent Girard. One pass too many. Kirkeloka. Any. Kirkeloka. Could and should have taken that one on himself and on the wing. It's a good piece of here. Saustrup, save by Gerard. Needs a moment to breathe. He's been running up and down. Up and be a hero again today. This guy goes in as the second line player. Mahé. Got some Mahé into the bottom right hand. After missing the entire of the main round. And that one spills out of Kirkeloka's hands. This guy on the break again. Lays it off. Dikamem, save, but a free throw given. Runs into Karabadu channel as we see of him. In the game today, and Aaron Mensing coming in for the first time at left back. Here he is. He does love a shot, and he's Karabatic. Oh, it's nice movement. Really nice movement by Kotsoma. He's got a killer shot on him as well. Here he is again, looking for space. He's found the space through the legs of the keeper. First goal of the game for our ball out to Deska. France. Mahé. Saved down low by Luka waiting in the right-hand side. Looks to go alone, maybe one step too many, but the referees don't. Mensing. Well, that one saved it. Dikamem. Mahe tries to break free, does break free. That'll be a penalty. And a two-minute suspension on attack. And Hugo Desca with the penalty against Nicolas Landin. And he finds a way past them at the bottom left-hand corner. It's another one for Hugo. They're well used to it. Mensa. That is a goal. In the end, taken by Nick. Mensing. Mensa. Across the hole. He goes low. Is it the Karabatic? 
Mahe coming in on the empty switch with plenty of speed, bringing his first man and earning a penalty. As he earns his penalty to be taken by Hugo Desca. He doesn't mess around with that. Fires that one straight. And as I said, hailing in comparison to Vincent Girard so far. Ball into the line to Seaman Hell. And he doesn't miss. Sweden was amazing. Ports. To Kanton Mahé, into Tornat on the line. He has the beating of his defender. Continue to score with ease. And Jakob Holm goes down heavily, and it's, it's going to be a two-man. Kirkeluka. Oh, nice, Nicholas Kirkeluka. Into the top right-hand corner. First goal. Mean. To Mahé again, awkward angle coming into that one. It's blocked down. Space on the right-hand side. Kirkeluka again. It's a two out of two. Just like in the semi-final, France racing out to win. In comes Nahi. Face there for the shot, but the angle was really... Great angle for that shot and shows just how... Back to Kirkeluka, almost evades him. Now he's got space. Goes to Gerard's sweet point in this match so far. And no goal. Now to Richardson. Two lefties in there in the backcourt. And again, Yannick. Mem now from 10 metres out. Crashes that one off the crossbar. Bufti in the left back position. He doesn't want to be there. Ball out to Mem on the wing. And wow, good finish by Yannis Len. Again, not a great angle for him. He'll lay that off and make his way back out to the right wing and try to create a bit of an overlap here. And squeezed in. For Stepping out to nine metres. Looking to take out Mean before he gets the shot away. Not sure what part of the... He'll come around to the centre on the empty switch. Put a bit of pace in the attack hole. Out to the wing. Landine at the near post. And we are level. Mean. Richard said. Dylan Nahi. Fires that one. Uh, Kirkaloka. But again. Position to do that. Ball across to Richardson. Out to the wing. This is a very fruitful area. But not now. And for the first time today. Giannis Lenz. The space there. Is that stolen? If so, brilliantly done. Mean. To Mem. Richardson. Fabregas waiting on the line, he gets it on the line and he finds a way past the keeper. First goal of the game for Ludovic Fabregas and with that, France have the... What is you know, a fascinating battle. They're coming back in. Mahé to Karabadic, runs into traffic but that sets it up nicely for the shot. Over Gerard. at the moment anyway. And there's the equal on it. Oh, great breakthrough and whip past the keeper, no chance there for Landine. Kirkaloka with some speed here, blocked down again and a fast break opportunity just like we had at the start of the first half. Ball over to the left hand side to Hugo Desca. He's oh. his trademark finish. Ball across to Mahe, out to the wing to Benoit Konku. Good finish. Away from Mensa in the center. Takes on Conan. Hall saves and the rebound. Port from about 10 meters and it's blocked down. Second half. Jakob Hall. Find space eventually through the legs of Vincent Girard. And Denmark back within a goal. Block from Saugstrup. Karabadic. This time a bit more space for Port. Lays it off. Oh, it's really good. I think everyone in the arena enjoyed that one. Except for Saugstrup and Landin. And Nicholas coming into the centre again. Valentin Port tries to break free. The pass is off though. Goes it for Alborg all the time. But for Denmark. A defensive player out and out. Oh, that one squeezes through the legs of Gerard. Nice move. Oh, Hugo Dasca comes in on the line. Tries to create a bit more space, and that in the 40% range, which is very good. Particularly for a game like this. <laughs> Picking his spots and he's scoring. Konku on the counter attack this time. Offman. Ball into Saugstrup. Oh, he left everyone behind there. Mahe. Is it off the car palace? You're looking a bit stuck in the center here. Crowding. That's a nice in flight pass, but inside. Coming out of his area there to. Well, first of all, that wasn't inside. Mensa into the line. What's Vansar Gerard doing? And then Gerard comes back, tries to intercept it. Mem back in, not right back, and here he is. Off the Karabadic, overlap on the left hand side, but the shot is poor. Denmark on the counter. Magnus Augstrup again. To nothing. So Konku goes in as a second line player. Karabadis tries to break free. Ball to Konku on the line, out to the left wing. Deska into the bottom right. In the end, nice movement. Ball out to the left wing. Deska 
And it's rely six for him today. Kirkulaka. It's a bit too simple in the end. They're a man up in that situation, and they job done at the moment. France trail by three. Them. Oh, it's good. Dikamet brought them to the semi-finals. And that shot blocked down and away goes Benoit Konku on the break against Landine. And France with a quick double. Out of the line. Hull. Oh, he leaves it behind. Spills out of his hand. Bit of a soft one to turn over. And Dika Mahem into the top. Why don't you just do it all the time, Dika? For the action. And it takes a shot immediately, and just like name. He keep plowing on. As will that man. Got on Mahay and so. switch brings Mensah into the center again. Kirkaluka. Mensing. Mensing has space to shoot, and Aaron Mensing with another rough second time around. Fair. 23 23. Ball into the line is a good one and a penalty. Overall, what can he do against Muller? Deska finds a way past Muller and gives France the lead again. So it's a great turnaround from this French team. And that's what he'll get. Another empty switch. Now he's in the centre. Will he take on the shot? He will indeed. <laughs> he was held before he even received the pass. That's going to be a suspension against Simon Hell. Already engaged in the battle before the ball even came in. Mem comes into the centre again. Looks for the pass this time. Clean through Nicolas Turnau. And that gives France the lead again. Dirk Luka backpedaling as he gets that one. Tries to find the line, but it's stolen. Once again, the empty switch brings Deacon Mem into play. There's the overlap on the left hand side. Benoit Konku with loads of space at the near post to place that one past the tonight for him. Try to find someone. And in the end, takes too many. On their feet here in the Budapest handball arena as Karabatic lays that one off. Brilliant pass to Konku, but a good save at the far post. Two line players in there again. Kirkaloka into hell and Seaman Hell. Oh, it's stolen. Great defending. And away goes Magnus Augstrup. Looks for help from Emil Jakobsen. And he finds a way past her. Augstrup. Good support by Emil Jakobsen. A matter of a minute. Back in this one. Left-handed shot and left. Mensing in the center. Out to Mensah. Kirkaluka. There's Lasses Vaughn immediately in the action. Looking to take on Mahe. Mem. Mahe. Oh, good stuff. Mensing. Kirkaluka into the line, but three defenders on top of him. That's Mensah. Mensing now. He's got the space. Oh, it's going to be a penalty and a penalty. Against Vincent Girard. Oh, it's kept out by Girard. Anton Mahé, all right, to the wing, perhaps, and Hugo Desca, ball across, but he was inside. It was Tansai. He can go himself. He does go himself eventually, but he loses. Line spills out, and there's an empty net to shoot into. Somebody has to shoot here. It'll be Lasses Vaughan in the end. Finally, Denmark go to extra time. On 28 goals, four minutes before the end. Tension rising, hand up for passive play. Deacon M. And it's a by ring to be. Exactly what we'd hope it to be. Mensing back out to Kirkaloka. Mensing overlap on the left hand side. Ball out to Emil Jakobsen on the wing. It's saved. Hey, Karabadic down the left hand side. And it's uh, Denmark. Oka okay, gets it out to the wing to Lasses Vaughan. Not a great angle for her, but it doesn't matter. Lasses Vaughan gives Denmark the lead with just over it. Hey, Karabadic. Karabadic has played practically the entire game. Lays it off to Dika Mem. Oh! Took a touch from a defender. To... There's that equaliser. It was hands over. Looks to add some pace. Here Kaloka. Aaron Mensing blocked and over. Right. In extra time in the bronze medal match. Oh, that's a silly turnover. And the ball will be turned over. Lauga goes low. Rasmus Lauga. That was the opening goal of extra time. Dika Mem to mean. Locked down at this time. Huge in extra time. Can Hull deliver it? Yes, he can. Dead down in the Danish defense. Looking the more solid at the moment. Favor his near post in that regard. Oh, that one comes crashing off the crossbar and out over the end line. So it's another let off to 
Rasmus Lauge, back pedals, goes at them again. Lauge bounces that one past. Denmark were looking to break here. Not much time left, and just before the buzzer. They finally get the first. Euro 2022. Denmark get the second half. Saugstrup moving in the backboard, and it's Jakob Holm again. There's the home goal. Two defenders on top of him. Man. Melvin Richardson in the backcourt as well, so it's all changed. Ball across to the right wing to Yanis Land, and it's well covered by Nicholas Landin. Posi Four goal game here. Could be it, could be good night, but Hans Arsenal has picked up by Fabregas. They have to go again, but they're wasting time here. Tornas save, Nicholas Landin. Could that be the bronze medal for Denmark? I will have to come in very soon. It's, oh, it's off the post. I think. Game. Dig push the pace. Then Richardson right through the center. Oh, good finish by Anton Gerard. Another important save. Look at Swan looking for the pass to Hall. Hall to Lauga. Lauga tries to dribble his way through. He does exactly that. Blazes it in time period, and that almost certainly is that. Then saved by Nicholas Rupp. Into Magnus Landin. He'll take a sweet time before taking a shot. He finds the backets. There will be no medal for them today. Fun coming for them. They've had heartbreak against France. But today, it's Denmark. Who... Uh, Lasse Svan, look at that. He's 